Hello, good morning. How are you? Can you all hear me? Yes, sir. Good morning. Okay, good morning. Still, some students are admitting to the meeting. So, shall we wait for a while? Since uh, this is the first time that we are meeting. I think altogether there are around uh, 160 students in your batch now. If you can pass this message to the students, uh, your friends, uh, if you have their contact numbers, so it will be more easy for us. So can you please ask them to join the meeting quickly? Okay. Okay, just one question. Uh, what do you feel now? Hmm? We have admitted to the tertiary education system of Sri Lanka. We are at the OVLS University. So what do you feel now? Excited. Yeah. Nervous. No. Okay. Hey, have you been to Avellas University physically? No. No. No, it's still not. No, not yet. All the things are on your hand. No, on the smart screen or whatever. <laughs> but sir, disappointed. We yeah. can't meet physically. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can understand that. I, I also uh, have the same feeling uh, for my higher studies. So <laughs> I have to go to New Zealand, but uh, still I am in Sri Lanka doing online. <laughs> so I can feel uh, what you are saying. Okay, there are around 148 until others come, uh, we'll start, no? Okay, please say it. Okay. Uh, So you all are welcome for my uh, lecture. Actually, I don't uh, like to do lectures, right? So I think uh, if we can go ahead with this as a discussion, so it will more worth, uh, I can answer your questions and uh, I can support you to get through this uh, education system uh, with a big success, right? So before that, uh, I will explain who I am. So. 
my name is Ishara Vijay Singh. So I will I will show you uh, some photographs. Uh, yeah, this. So can you all uh, see what I shared? Yes. Okay. So. So, so this is my uh, first day school up to a scholarship exam, uh, very beginning uh, of my life. Uh, so then this is the next up to ordinary level, right? So those two are rural colleges. Uh, I think you may all know this. Uh, so I did my A levels here, Dharmaraja College, Kandy, right? So then uh, I attended to Uavellas University. I did Palm and Latex Technology and got a second upper, right? In uh, 2014, right? Uh, then I attended to uh, Sri Jayavardhanapura University and did my master's degree in polymer science and technology and got the GP of 4.4 of 4.4, right? Got the maximum. And then I'm doing my PhD at uh, the University of Auckland, New Zealand, right? So if you want to find about me more, uh, you can understand who I am. So you can see, uh, my profile in the department website, if you go to export agriculture department, so you can see here me. And uh, yeah. Yes, yes, some have asked that uh, uh, I'm going to do lectures or not. Uh, yes, uh, I will not do lectures this time, but we don't know. Sometimes we can't predict the future, no? Uh, we don't know what will happen in near future. Uh, we'll see. We'll allow the things to decide by the future, no? Okay, then... Uh, have you all sub, uh, have you all come to the lecture so here 151 so in not done and uh, if you prefer to know more, uh, I have written several uh, newspaper articles for reputed newspapers. So this is for Ceylon Today, and this is for Vidusara, and Daily News, again Daily News. Uh, and if you want to see my research profile, you can go to the research gate and search my name. So then you will find. And also you can go to the Google Scholar, right? Then uh, search my name. So then my all the research will come to you, right? So you can understand the standing position of me. So that is, that is uh, just to show that uh, who I am and what I have done, right? So I hope uh, you don't uh, want to take me as a role model or a picture uh, that uh, you expect to go, right? You should be a unique person to yourself. So being the unique, right? I think uh, you can do more than me, right? So you have to make your own room, your own space, right? So then you will be a unique person. Then you can do more uh, to the world, right? That should be your hope. Okay. Then uh, 
today i want to discuss this right okay can you see my presentation yes sir okay 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 uh here is what so i thought to use this uh, title because uh, these things uh, will not be uh, taught by anybody to you right so that's why i thought uh, to discuss in this uh, topic uh, i don't know whether other lecturers have teach this but not it is not needed to teach but as graduates uh, you have undergraduates you have to think of this right but we'll we'll have some discussion on this right so a story that nobody will teach you right so keep calm and think responsibly right so that's the main idea we have we have we don't want to be excited right we have to keep calm and we can think responsibly what the country and people and the nation expect from me right so how i can contribute to my country and the world right everything you have to think responsibly now you are in the tertiary education system so you have to be keep calm and think responsibly right i will show you how you have to do this right that's only okay then uh, i think you all have your email addresses no if i if i put uh, one thing to your email can you go through this quickly i will put one link to your email right so so i think uh, you may click on that and you will go to a website okay are you ready this is small small uh, there are small questions you have to type your answers there Are you ready? I also put it in your chat room. you have to enter your name and you can uh, click on the answer Did you go to that website called Paul Everywhere? Yes. Sir. Okay. Can you see the question? Yes. 
Okay, uh, please answer that. Yeah, I will share your answers with you. Uh, right. Okay, can you see your answer? I know the history, vision, and mission of UWU. Means you know that, no? 80%, around 80% of you know the history, vision, mission of Uwellas University. Is that? Okay, however, uh, I will activate the next question. Yeah. Majority has said that uh, we are saying this Sri Lanka is a developing country for a long period of time. No, we have been saying that. <laughs> yeah, that's what happened to us. Okay, the next one. Yeah, so this is a good attitude, right? You want to stop saying developing, but you hope to say the developed country means uh, you all are in a thirsty to develop this country, you know? So very good, right? So, right, thank you very much for answering that, right? So we'll go to the uh, presentation now. Okay, you know, you and me and all of us are suffering due to money. We, we say that we are a developing country, right? We are a developing country because of what? We don't have money, right? We don't have money. That's the reason, right? If we have enough amount of money, right? So we don't want to say that we are, de we are a developing country. Do you know? the earning of a person in sri lanka today right it's around 4000 us dollars That's right gdp per capita is 4000 us dollars gdp per capita means gdp means the total earning of the country per year right so it will be divided by the number of people in the world in uh, number of people in sri lanka uh, in in that particular year Right, so then one person get about four thousand US dollars for a one year of time, right? So if we divide it by twelve and convert it into rupees, one person should get around sixty six thousand rupees per month, right? Are you getting that? We are not getting that, right? See how many people are getting more than six uh, around uh, 65,000 rupees per month, right? How many of are not getting that, right? That's why we are saying that we are poor, 
right? So, have you seen some doctors and high professionals and businessmen, right? So, they are earning more than that, right? They earn around two lakhs of rupees per month. Right, so that is the required GDP per capita, right? So you may have said, if a couple, or father and mother, can earn around two lakhs, so they are uh, they are spending their lives more easily, right? So they can buy what their needs, they can take what are the services that they want, right? So this is the required amount of uh, money for living in country as a developed nation, right? So are we getting this? So this is the biggest challenge that we are facing. If we cannot achieve the GDP per capita of 12,000 US dollars within next five, 10 years, right? We will suffer more than this. Can you understand what I am saying? Dolos Dahak US dollars, take a put galet out of the turn, Karan Barinang, meet a vada, dukita tata, near at a patina. Well, I take a tear another. Why that's yeah? Yes, you can ask any question. No problem. Language is not a problem. Because we don't have money to spend to purchase our needs and wants. Right? So, do you know what is the best solution to achieve this? Right? It is through education. Right? So, one best example is we are sending uh, house uh, cleaners and uh, mechanics, uh, like uh, low order skilled people to other countries for their services then we earn very little amount for the GDP, right? But if we can send a person who uses their brains and minds, right? Let's say if we send a scientist to Rolls-Royce, right? Or else if we send a researcher to NASA, right? If we send our uh, um, high skilled uh, motor mechanician to Tesla. So what will be the earning, right? Are we doing that or are we sending our poor people to uh, Middle East countries? No, can you understand? So if, if we educate our people, right, definitely they will go to the high level salaries, right, since their skills are in high order, right. So the next thing is, if you are educated more, right, you will start new businesses, right, you will be a technologically sound people, right, so then you will earn this in future, right, if not, Think responsibly, you will suffer more than this situation, right? Why can't we close our country during the pandemic? We don't have big amount of economy. We don't have savings, right? But think of other countries. Some are doing it very nicely, no? Yes, so one person has us do the educated people send money. Yes, that that they are sending, right? But they are earning money. But the, we, we need to 
change the system right like uh, what india is doing right they sent technicians like what uh, china people are doing right you know we take china te technicians and scientists from china to develop the port city right we take uh, uh, engineers from there right so aren't we paying them right we have to pay them right so likewise we if we can send our set of engineers to build a huge building in middle east right middle east should pay for our engineers right so you are talking about personally people are going abroad and they earn and they they spend their lives in such countries right they do not send money that's okay educated people earn karanna right so we will learn more we we can we can send educate one educated people to compensate for unskilled labor right unskilled ek hatara deneking vitara hoyena salli apita educated ek kenegen genna puluwa right so that's why the education is more powerful if you start more businesses think of that right okay you can look at yourself now right you know the government allocation for the education so government spends 2 to 4% of its gdp for your education right so it's a kind of big amount of money but it is not enough right but we blame every time no because of that we don't have full of resources to use right Be with this gdp allocation we have a manageable amount of facilities right so we have to use that and we have to go th through it and we have to contribute to increase this gdp right but what we are doing we do not see that we have manageable amount of resources we don't have money so we have to do something about with this manageable amount of facilities right and we have to we have big responsibility to increase this gdp but without doing that uh, we blame right we blame others all the others let's say one government came and it go it will go on right then another come and it will go on right likewise we change the governments right so who are the people come to the government some people from our community will come across through the uh elections is ele election election elections and uh, they they start to rule the country right so what we have done right we don't want to wait until them to do right so we have to think of what we are doing right without blaming all the others we have to blame ourselves api apitam benagatto taman taman tam mamunada karala thiyenne kiyala ne etagota eke ite wada watinu hari well, the, the, the money allocation for you to learn in Uwavilas University, right? Cost of you is around 7 lakhs, right? For this time, it may be more, right? So if you are asked to take this money from your home and pay to the university and learn, so what will happen to you? Most of you will not come across to the uh, secondary education, to ter tertiary education, right? Right? Some people will do, but most of you will not do. Right? So the government and the people who knows you and who don't know you, right? Right? So you don't know that, you have, but you have to do that. That's why I ask you to keep calm and think responsibly that you are liable to the nation. So we should know a way to pay the loan we taken from the nation. We took from the nation. Right? So you have that responsibility can you understand that
Yes, friends, can you understand that? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah. Yes, sir. Have you think of this well before? Yes, sir. Yeah, some of you may have, but some of you may not have, right? Okay. We'll see this example, right? So this will show the power of education, right? So you know what is this? This is the uh, the percentage of prisoners in Sri Lanka. Categorized based on their education level. Right? Around 85% of prisoners are having their education level up to grade 8 only. Atavasara pass which I attend a kang visala pirisak in Hiragewal lola. I can Hiragewal lola in the Minisungim visala pirisak. See it a super hack with a parcela tini atavasara to with a right. And if you take the percentage, most of the prisoners, right, have passed only grade eight. They have not gone to all levels, A levels, and degree level, right? See, the number percentage is increasing up to this. And once they, once uh, the education is strength, the people, right, all level, A level, and through, edu through degree, level, degree level education. So, can you see the amount of prisoners? If we take cumulative of this around 15%, right? See, here, Pahala Pitra Tamai, prisoners line. May may higher secondary level Udatawa, Saha, tertiary education got. So if we can take all the people, all the students, all the children through this education channel up to degree level, right? My hope is everybody should get a degree, any kind of degree, or higher diploma or a diploma, right? So everybody should take. That's my hope. Right, so then we can close all the prisons, right? So is it good or bad? Do we need prisons? What's your idea? See how many prisons are there in Sri Lanka? Some prisons are there in Sri Lanka bigger than the faculties of the university. Right, bigger than the faculties of the university, some are bigger than the OLS university. Right, so see how we use our resources. So, we need to strengthen our, edu strengthen our education system. Right, that cannot be done only through the facilities. Right, we have to train, we have to change our mindset of the children right and his students just so you have that responsibility you can you can change your uh, peers mindset and your friends mindset right so you can support others to others to learn right so take that responsibility and then do you know your level at which level are you now can you please answer? So according to NV, here is NVQ levels. This is your qualification and this is your level according to Sri Lanka quality framework, SLQF here. So what is your level? You have passed A level, no? Advanced level, no? That's why you are here, no? Yes, sir. Yeah. So then you are at NVQ level four. You have passed the NVQ level four already. But according to Sri Lanka quality framework levels, you are at the second level, right? But now you are doing bachelor's honors, four year special degree. Wow. So you have passed all the NVQ levels. Don't bother about NVQ, right? National vocational qualification. Don't bother about it. You have passed it right you are at the slqf level 6 
so i will put all these links later right so you can find those links and read them right so it will more su uh, supportive for you uh, to plan your future right so you are at the level 6 so which the nvqs cannot touch you right so you are at a good position and your responsibility is that much high now oyage waga kima godak wedi me velave hari you are at the level 6 right you have to do more to the nation right not by your hands right but with your brains and the way you think right the way you think creates a new world ehema neda api hitana vidiyath ekka loke wenas wenawa neda ko balanna ehem wenna nae kiyana if you think in a new way right you will develop a new world right world is what you think ekem pita deyak nahe world is what you think right okay so this is case i am model knowledge skills attitudes and mindset so knowledge the curriculum of eag t plt will give you the knowledge and there are so many works to do by your hands right you have to do team work critical thinking managerial entrepreneurial information management like skills so and practical farming and everything so you will improve your skills knowledge and both right but what about this attitudes and mindset if you if i ask you me prashna hoda ragana right if i ask you there's a couple mother and father one is doctor and other one is a nurse ekane doctor kene kanith ekana nurse kene who is the doctor who is the nurse mother or father what is coming to mind maybe the doctor is the father is that yes yes that's your mindset but can't be the mother is the doctor we can but we don't we don't think no <laughs> and nurse when when you heard hear the term nurse what will come to your mind a lady wearing a white frock yes is that yes sir. yes yes that's our mindset right mindset means how we see the world right if you wear a blue color glass you will see the world in blue color like that mindset is the way you feel the world way you think right dekka neda nurse kiyana kota apita enne lady kene doctor kiyana kota enne pirimi kene so that is your pair of glass so means the mindset well okay dakine vidiya thamai ye but it is not wrong but some kind of uh, mistakes are there no eke podi veraddat tiyena wageni so based on that you you behave no based on that you behave that's why you said that the father is the doctor so that is the behavior no you said wa katha kara eke wenuwe eken wage behavior eke the way you think shows how you behave wa hitana vidiyata thama oya kriyatmaka ne then the way you think will create a new world right so we can measure your mindset based on your attitudes means how you behave right so if i share one uh, video with you so i don't know whether you will uh, uh, whether you will uh, hear the sound but uh, this is a good video right so i will share it uh, we'll see uh, you all can Uh, see hear that can you hear the sound of this video not yet sir you can't hear the sound no? mm. okay uh shall i share this link uh, through your emails now 
then we all can go to that link and we can uh, watch this video this is a 5 minutes video what do you think of abi tikak kammelikam yandath ekka meka balamu okay yes okay okay i will stop sharing and uh, i will share the link uh, with your emails right now okay you can uh, go to your emails and just click on the youtube link that i have sent you have you received that okay do you know what uh, your country expect from you right i will tell uh, what is the expectation of your country from you right so means what you have to do to this country right to develop that right before that you should know what are the sectors that you can contribute right education sector agriculture sector technology sector industry right economic sector there are different types of sectors in the country there are around 48 sectors in the country right so to which sectors that you are belong to is very much important to think bef uh, before you are going to contribute right but i do not want to confine you to these sectors but you can contribute to any sector that you prefer and if you are capable enough var puluwan na ඕනෙම සෙක්ටර් එකට වගේ contribution එක දෙන්න පුළුවන් at once ඔය එක පාර හෝ keep එක වර keep වතාවකට right that depends on your skills attitudes mindset and your knowledge right uh, sometimes you can contribute to the agriculture sector at the same time you can contribute for the education sector both right so low end එක එක දෙයකට වෙයි සමත right it is is that true ඒක කියන්න බල ලොවෙන් එකෙක් එක දෙයකට වෙයි සමත. I believe that. No. We can't believe that, no. Right? Who knows? See, some people are doing many things, no? They are doing well in different sectors, right? So you ඒක කියලා තියෙන දරු ඒක ඒක අහගෙන ඉන්න කියලා නෙමෙයි. ඒක බිඳින්න කියලා තමයි කියලා තියෙන්නේ. හරිද? අපි ඒක අහගෙන ඉන්නවනේ නේ. Right? We should know how to break that. so that is the milestone to break right not to worship right so but directly you are belong to the agriculture sector right so i put here new technologies not a conventional paddy field right so see smart agriculture this is called smart agriculture you know so vertical agriculture smart agriculture right hydroponics and many new things right not the conventional actually we we have to move from the conventional agriculture and we have to go to the smart agriculture right you know 7% of the gdp of sri lanka is the is come uh, is coming from the agriculture sector right so we are in that sector we should know and we should have the responsibility to double this right to double this with new technologies right and plantation sector tea coconut rubber right so and the manufacturing sector right tires different types of tires right see military tires and here white tires right and uh, glove sector right industrial gloves medical gloves and different types of rubber products right so you know the worth of this business around 1 to 2 billion us dollars industry right we earn this much even in this period of time 
right you know the expectation of the development of this industry in 2030 right have you gone through the uh, the rubber uh, master plan of the rubber in sri lanka so i will put those links in my channel so then you can go there and you can uh, find those master plans right in 2030 it hope to double this value 4 billion us dollar industry right so see this the sri lankan icon the ceylon tea right so different types of teas are there right it is also 1 to 2 billion worth us dollar industry right so and the coconut industry coconut food and non food materials right non food products it's around 600 million us dollar industry we should know and we have the responsibility to double this right if you can do more so it's it's up to you right so think differently think in new way so then you will do this right okay so have anybody gone through the uh, budget of this year the budget of the government praje government me budget ta ka balapu lamai ko kaudu hari kiyu ada budget ta ka budget highlights anybody yes or no no sir no many of you may not do wala vitaranne me kisi kenek me karanne but we blame one government came we blame it right so then we put our vote to the another one right we take another government right again we blame for five years right so this is the routine job of the people in sri lanka but they don't know what they have to do if any government comes or came in past or will come in future have to set only one set of goals ekamma goal set ekak thamai hadanna issara haduwet eka issara ta hadanna thiyenne eka dan thiyenne eka why the country is still in the same state same position hitapu thanama thiyena ratak issara ta geniyanna nan hadanna thiyenne e thanata adala e me objectives e goals tika vitaramai kavuru avar right until the people realize what is their role the people who rule the country have to set only one set of goals right but different governments use different types of words to set that same goals right that's it nothing beyond that right so that's why i asked you to read the uh, budget right so it will show the allocation so see here uh, this is related to you plantation and agriculture this is mostly related to you right not all right so we'll see this what are the goals so what is the allocation here 9 billion rupees for plantation 55 billion rupees for agriculture the highest allocation right for agriculture right and what is the expectation expectation is export oriented competitive plantation sector right export oriented competitive plantation sector is required to this country right to do that the people have allocated around 9 billion rupees right so what we have to do with this this is these are the things you have to do you have to promote value added products for tea rubber and coconut you think are you capable enough to do this right without without the education can you do this without coming through the university or whatever the higher type of higher education can you do this can you improve the quality infrastructure can you do uh, start new businesses right can you improve the traditional products to new products right can you support to small holders right can you can you value add to your ceylon spices traditional spices right can you do that can you diversify the coconut industry without knowledge without education can you do this nobody can do that right that's why i told you the education is the most powerful tool to develop this country right okay well let's see the agriculture sector 
See, 55 billion rupees, but what is the expectation and what is what we have to do? We have to make technologically driven agriculture, technology driven agriculture economy, right? For making innovative, highly productive and profitable agrarian economy. Educated people are required, no? We need educated people to do this, right? In some countries, some people are saying that I am a farmer, right? Proudly they are saying that I am a farmer. But can it be uh, done in Sri Lanka? If in Sri Lanka, if a person says that uh, I am a farmer, what will happen to him? Nobody will care, no? Who cares? He is a farmer. Who cares? No? What's your opinion? That's why the smart agriculture is required, right? So to do the smart agriculture, the people who are doing the agriculture should be educated. Terunada. Can you understand what I am saying? Yes. Okay. Uh, who has said uh, uh, T2066, uh, she has said that uh, wrong for that fraud in the chat room. Yes. What is wrong? Yes, you can tell me. Then we can we can discuss it. Okay, until he or she comes, uh, we'll go ahead, right? Okay, to achieve that, we need to improve the education system, right? So see, 1.5 billion rupees for science, technology, engineering, and uh, medicine degrees, right? So promote these, it's around uh, 1.5 billion rupees, right? Please wait, excuse me for two seconds. Okay, uh, and 3.5 billion rupees for technology faculties, 1.6 billion rupees for developed universities. And you can see we need IT, right? When you go ahead with this situation, right? And a smart national global innovation hub is the uh, goal of our education system. Think. Are you ready to do, do that yourselves or not, right? That's your responsibility. Keep calm and think responsibly. Okay, that's all about the things uh, I wanted to talk with you. But uh, now I think uh, it's better to discuss what are the challenges you face uh, in the university life, right? Okay. I asked this question from uh, through the emails. Uh, some people have said that uh, they have problems with English, ICT, mathematics, and science, right? So if you want to refresh this knowledge and if you want to improve your English, your ICT knowledge and mathematics and science, so there are okay. I love it. wrong. Yes, that's wrong. Okay, thank you very much. Right. Mm. So if you want to learn these, right, you don't want to go behind anybody, right? So there are good platforms to learn them, right? There are platforms. The best platform is this DP Education, Sri Lanka's largest online school, right? Go to DP Education website right then you can learn english from grade 1 to grade 13 right while at own with the english again again the pull one platform like a dp education a sri lankan product by the millionaire number one millionaire of sri lanka 
Dominica Pereira, right? So I think make a watino alamai Lanka we have been a manikwal at a vada make a watino. It is full of free. And if you if you want to start a, uh, a tuition class, uh, it is free to take the teaching material from this website, and you can learn by yourself, and you can teach it to somebody else, right? No need to pay money, right? So that much important. So please go through this, improve your English language knowledge, and improve your ICT knowledge, and you can do mathematics. There, yeah, you can do science, whatever the subject you want to do in any language you prefer. If you want to learn them in English, you can do Sinhala, you can do, and Tamil, you can do, right? So, Tamil people, you can learn from your language, right? And if you prefer to learn more on any subject, let's say one student is there, he, he or she prefers to do a business management course once you uh, learn uh, in the university of OLS, right? If you want to learn a business management online course in a reputed university in the world, right? Loke owner, Cambridge, Oxford, uh, Auckland, whatever the top class university, right? If you want to learn uh, any kind of uh, online course of such a university, you have to go to DP Digital University. There are around 8,000 online courses in management stream, science stream, maths stream, engineering stream, whatever the streams you prefer, right? You can do it freely. So the thing is you have to do is you have to go to digital university of DP and explore the free courses. What you prefer, right? You can do, you can learn, right? Logate a top class university free online courses digital university dp you have the chance right and if you want to learn some other subjects right you can go to the e taksala website of ministry of education sri lanka right so it is again in uh, three languages sinhala english and tamil so you can choose your language and you can learn any kind of subject here right uh, history whatever right any kind of subject okay then money will be another challenge for you emma venavada some people may feel the money is a challenge for you to study. Yes, I know that some students are there. Money is a, a challenge for them, right? Okay, how do you think innovatively? Api meka gana tika amutu vidya tahi tuwa kohamada mani ekata mama solution neka gain How can I take a solution for my money problem, right? If I am you, right, I will do this. I know that uh, I have the strength to teach. Mata ugana na pulwa, sa mata kene te kiela dena pulwa kiela mata teere no, right? I can understand, I can teach, and I can explain something to understand, right? Um, so, if I am coming to Uwa, right? If I can start to teach somebody, I can earn money. At the same time, I can support others to. Learn. Ne anitta iti ganaga nu dau karan na pulwa. Mata sali hamba karan na pulwa. Mata ti ganaga nda pulwa. Right. So if I can do, I have to do an analysis, no? So how do how I can do that? Right. You know, around fifteen thousand students are come for A levels, but only ten thousand passed, and around six thousand six thousand students are not qualified for A levels. A level level to high the hack with a lama qualify when now a province. Sorry. And A level fail. Around 5,000 fails their A levels. See the count. And if we go with the course objects, around 
40 to 50 percent of his students are failing science, English, and mathematics. In my subject, Puna may see at Hatalia, Panaha, Katar Pramania, Lamai, fail in our province. In the May Gooding. If we go through the A level, physical science, maths, bio, biosystem technology, E tech, right? Around 40 to 50 percent of his students are failing their subjects. Do you know all F number of his students? Number of his students who are getting all F, F tuna, around 1000. So this is a good room to you to make money, right? You have to decide I should do tuition and earn money. Once you do tuition, right, they will learn and they will get through the exams in next time. At the same time, you will earn money. So both way, it is a good solution, right? It is a good solution, right? And you can do them through YouTube, right? You can start online platform. You all have smartphones. Kochara sali na thati smartphone ne ka kula me gya the nathi vidya koya gan namaori. You can start your own business through this and ask from your seniors. So they are doing eBay, right? So you can do an online business once you are learning, right? So think differently and earn money. The next one is stress. Methani nal balum is stress in alamai. Odi data is stress in aya. Is there? Yes, sir. Yes, his stress is the anatomical stress cell and in the university, right? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Right? <laughs> right, okay. How do you manage your stress? Uh, did you did you went through the did you go through the um, mentoring program? Yes, sir. Okay, so mentoring is a good solution for this, so it is workable, right. But I think you take a paper and pen once you are stressed, right? Take a paper and pen, write your questions for the stress. Right? Then see again and check whether they are actually problems may not really what any problems the natamme hite tiyana prashna da right critically think on them right then you can select what are the most important questions to you right then you can suggest your own solutions oyagema uttara tewata denna right then get advices from if you like your parents or your friends go to them and Talk with them, right? Get advices, take their suggestions, take their ideas, right? Then you can meet your mentors and discuss with them, right? And at the end, you decide your own decision, right? Sometimes you may you may take the decision of removing all the papers you wrote the your questions. Somehow, all the ultimate in all my me questions go back. Yeah, you know, you know, got a question. Liana will call it up it a deal. I know. Amy will have to, you know, her the no stress at the end. Right. Hey, guy. So once you go through this, uh, I think uh, this will support for you and uh, you can find some solutions for stress uh, through your uh, religion right through your religion so if you do so you are a smart person right and religion and cultural conflicts in the university you will you will face this sometimes religion related or culture related uh, conflicts somehow university still you know right so you better to know everything is a creation of your mind Right, nothing beyond that. Think wisely, broadly think, right, on these problems. Then if you realize it, 
uh, as a creation of mind then no point to make battle among each other anith ate ka prashna athi kar ganna avashyanai me hama demo ata hitena vidiya kiyala therum gatto if you understand all the things are the way you think your mindset then no point of making battles among each other right be careful okay then do you like to get a good result yes sir yes that should be your hope no yeah but do you know your result is your knowledge skills and attitudes all a collection of your knowledge skills and attitudes you should know this mena meka tamu oyage result ek kiyala kiya right so you have to attend the lectures regularly and improve your knowledge and improve your thinking pattern right that is mo- the most important one improve your thinking pattern right then do the practical once you do the practical train your hands and brain right that is called psychomotor skills right train your hands and brain right so then you will improve your skills right then use e portals right websites and read e books and some relevant books in the library and read magazines and get notes evage notes gan right ilanga to share your knowledge with peers this is very much important to you right to achieve a good result share your knowledge anith ayata kiyala denna hama velayima kiyala denna hama velayima mukak hari deyak gana katha karanna hari then try to change their attitudes if they are not in your level right so then next if you have to read a read an assignment right read beyond that limit api hitamu if you if you are asked to write a, write an assignment on sri lanka lanka wa gena rachanaya kliyanna kiyala denawa so how do you think how do you start can somebody tell me your assignment is write about your country ara ekath ona api hitamu myself wara denawa myself liyanna kiyala myself ithin eka vindan liyana ekane so you have to write about yourself so how do you do that kohomada ayak karanne first of all thinking about myself okay that's okay that's okay i am asking uh, what are the uh, things you are going to write there uh, achievements and mm. likings mm. hobbies yeah others singhali ngar kyan no problem but tamil alin kyan pa i can't understand i can understand i can't understand tamil kohom the myself wage ek ideas yeah a brief introduction mm. okay name address yeah i think all the things are conventional no you are in to 2021 end of the 2021 all the myself is uh, <laughs> conventional no still yes satsar satsar has said that uh, his family has a gym it is him right maybe good right <laughs> but you should uh, you are the one who creates the value to that right bol mani kak wenawada nattam world class gym ekak wenawada kiyana ekat you have to decide right <laughs> ඕකේ ටිකක් හිතන්න බලන්න ටිකක් වෙනස් විදියට කොහොමද මේක කියන්නේ 
ඒක තමයි කියන්නේ think out of the box right so හිතල බලන් right හිතල බලන් okay so but uh, when you submit the assignment uh, think what are the actually required things for this assignment but you know beyond that but you have to confine the knowledge based on the limits of the assignment අවශ්‍ය ප්‍රමාණයේ විතරක් සබ්මිට් කරන්න ඒකත් ඔයාලා ටැක්ෆුල් වෙන්න ඕනේ but uh, you should have the knowledge beyond the limits හරි ඒ දෙන අසයින්මන්ට් එකට එහා ඔයාලට knowledge එකක් තියෙනවා හරි okay always make questions yourself and answer by yourself right once a lecture is lecture is finished you have to develop your own questions regarding that lecture for the practical හරි ඔයාලා ප්‍රශ්න හදන්න ඒකල ඔයාලම උත්තර ලියන්න දැන් share among yourself right uh, and other with others right so uh, are you doing this uh, making uh, mind stories when you finish a sub particular subject you can create a, a story in your mind right then you can be a part of that maybe a, an actor producer or whatever right then you can perform that drama from your mind so then you will not you you will not want to uh, memorize it because it is uh, a story in your mind right vage manase kathawak eke etokota oya e charithayak eke right etokota memorize kara kara inna deyak naha everything will come uh, suddenly right and relax with leisure and do sports right take all the things as a part of your life if you want to have a good result right that is the achievement of your country because you will do more to your country so that's why i asked you to learn for your life not for the examinations right keep it in your mind learn for the life not for the examinations and after the university or sometimes within the university i prefer to go this is this the thing that the nation expect from you worshiping others for a job struggling to have a job hmm? is this the expectation is this the expectation of uh, spending money on you no i think that shouldn't be don't let so all these things are political right but you will realize these things once you are getting more aged right maybe 40 years 50 years others have cheated you right others have wasted your time wasted your money right for their political reasons right don't let others to cheat and waste your life for unwanted things right instead you can be smart in finding solutions right you should be smart enough to find the better solutions or the best solution uh for your questions or the problems right don't let others to waste you right all the things are politics okay at the end if you do those and if you think responsibly and being calm and quiet right you will realize at the end you will be called for jobs right you will get good jobs or else you will say you have started your own business right i have my own business i have a job right i earn this much right so then you will say i can't keep uh, i can't keep calm because i got the job or i started my own job right or my own business right you will say that definitely right so be a qualified person with good attitudes good attitudes who can challenge challenge the world and contribute to the development of your nation so that's the end of my presentation and i don't want to say thank you at the end because i hope to thank you if you achieve these goals 
at the at that time i will thank you all right okay then any problem you have so you can uh, pass to me so then we can have a discussion Okay, friends, is there anything to uh, know from me? Do you want to share anything with me? Any uh, thing to get clarified about the university life? And uh, thank you, my Prashna. Sorry, uh, I have to, everyone in meeting, right? Uh, I shared my uh, YouTube channel with you in the chat room, right? So there I discuss uh, the, some uh, parts of uh, some, some knowledge and uh, um, some lectures on uh, rubber technology and uh, if you prefer the rubber technology and I am doing some educational discussions there. So if you prefer, you can go to my channel and uh, you can subscribe that. Uh, so when, when I uh, put a new lecture or some uh, practical demonstrations regarding rubber technology, um, so you will receive those uh, messages, right? So I am on YouTube. Uh, so you can uh, find my channel uh, through the link I put in the chat room. So that is never ever. The name of the channel is never ever. So I will put uh, this uh, discussion on uh, that channel and I will uh, put some um, links in, under the description of the channel. So then you can click on those uh, links and you can go uh, to those websites and read them, right? So then, you will understand what I told. And uh, anything to be get clarified? What is the good uh, GPA marks to get a good job? in PLD. Actually, to get a good job, you don't want to bother about your GPA. That's my answer. I want to be realistic. Mama Ogolo Borwat is stress karan no nani. Get a first class, right? Get a second upper, get a second lower, right? Get a general, right? My personal uh, idea is GPA is not a limitation for you to find a job because i know that there are my uh, friends uh, in my batch uh, in 2014 right when i am earning for i am earning nothing right until i uh, do you know do you want to know uh, how i came as a lecturer just on the mic and tell yes right yes, so, yeah. yes sir. <laughs> yeah. no need no need to put uh, the chat uh, messages right you 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 have the mouth and you have ideas you can tell it no problem right mm. i finished uh, my bachelor's degree in plt in 2014 right it is around uh, august 2014 um 
then uh, i went to lalan rubbers you may have heard lalan rubbers private limited lalan yes. groups yeah yes sir yes i was a junior production executive there i got that job after my uh, industrial training and the research project so when i was uh, in the uh, interview there was another my friend right mage aluku titiya interview ekak api denna mekata giye but i had a second upper but he had a general degree right he got through the degree very difficulty with money stress and everything right i supported him well but uh, we both unfortunately we both attended this attended for this uh, attended uh, for a same interview for a same position ekkama ekata api denna giye now what will happen based on the gpa they will select me em nae de wenne actually they selected me mawa thamai gatte wala danna de etandi una de wala koma danna ne kiyanne do right so i asked the interview panel right i asked the interview panel he is one of my friend right i know that i have a good gpa and i can find, he has some uh, money matters right he is a good person he has good attitudes i know because i am uh, he is a friend of me for four years right i know him well and if i get this job he will lose this right sometimes this opportunity can be the whole of his life his life right so if you can please give my chance to him that's my last answer for that interview man antime the interview we ki we ka so then they again called him at the same time and they give they gave that job to him ya te job ek dunna and the interview panel especially called me and asked me to come for the job then they gave two positions to avila sir for me and my friend so that's how i faced my first interview there another yes sir okay api e wage wenno one eka daruwo gpa eken wat oyale kohen wat enne ne it should come through your heart adawa thing eka enno one hari tawa kenek api ata denno one tawa kenek adagen yanno one hari da habai there was another there was another student who missed his batch batch ek miss una due to one subject right but he is a talented guy right he is a talented guy and uh, he did some extra external courses slsi and some uh, management courses right on behalf uh, other than the uh, degree right so though he missed the batch he got a job in mass holdings you know mass ms have you heard that yes right he got the job do you know the value of his uh, job it is 60000 rupees per month in 2014 අපි 2015 වෙනි 17 වෙනි කතා කරේ දරු රුපියල් 50000ක ජොබ් එක කර ගියොත් හරි තමයි කියලා. ගොඩ කියලා. හරිද? මම gedara innakota mage badge visich yaluwa 60000 rupees walta job එක කර යනවා. See everything is the way you think. Your attitudes, your how you perform. right not the value of the gpa what is the value 3 point or something 2 point or something 4 point right 4.0 nothing beyond that right actually my uh, my argument is that value cannot decide who you are there are so many talented people right so many talented people who don't have a good gpa 
Make mama ki anne na hai. I don't want to say that you don't want to achieve a good GPA. But if you can achieve a good GPA with good attitudes, good other skills and all, so you are genius, right? But in reality, everybody cannot achieve first classes. Everybody cannot achieve second uppers. Most of the students are getting general degree, right? So that is the reality. If we take a batch of people, only two or three first classes, five, six uh, second uppers, then around uh, uh, seven, eight or 10 uh, second lowers, all the others get general. Some are failed, right? But that is not the whole of your life, right? You have number of opportunities, but all the things will come to you if you are capable enough to face challenges, right? You develop your attitudes, develop your presentation skills, right? How you present who you are to the world, then you will create your own opportunities. Be unique. Don't be a dependent of your GPA. But if you achieve good GPA, maybe second upper or first class, definitely you can become as, a, as an academic in the, uni, in the university system, right? Or researcher, you can become as a researcher, you can become as a scientist, more easily you can become, right? So that's it. And it will, it will ease to you find uh, some, uh, some government jobs and some jobs in universities and higher education institutes and as well as some other abroad universities. So for other jobs, the class is not a uh, thing to worry. Theron Monkey Vega. Any problem? Uh, is so is the product development area in limited to food sector? No, you can do any product development under EIG, right? Don't confine to your syllabus. Mage argument right? You don't want to confine to your syllabus, right? So when I was a student at my uh, BSc degree, right? I, I didn't attend to the lectures of science and technology faculty and management faculty, but I read their books and notes. You are in a university, you have the library and you have online facilities, right? So you can browse the things and you can learn whatever the things you want, right? Don't think that you are learning export agriculture. I have to do these things, all the things under the export agriculture. Nothing that, right? Actually, Taman Karneka can I hit under the Akna, Ethan, Yaha, the Valtama Hitan, Muga, the Karneka, Pomat Kiran other. Aka see him, Harry Rahimida Karagan, eh? Ethan, Yaha, the Val Hitan. Hurry. Metanahano, Matame Samar, Prashna, Miss Sena Pulwang, Katia Haneva, may Enisa Vala Pulwanang may word dwelling a hand may make any. Mike Conker Lahan, eh? Can anyone do MSc degree? Yes, you all can do MSCs, you all can do PhDs, you all can do Doctor of Science, DSCs, if you are courage enough. Hamade Mwaga mind again. If you are courage enough, you can do DSC, Doctor of Science, you can do postdoctoral even. Right, postdoctoral. Doctor Great Tegano Tehapati Devil to Alar Karanapur. Right. If you want, if you are doing export agriculture, if you plan to do go to NASA, you can do. Right, you can do. Come the export agriculture, NASA and any. Think. It is all of how you think. Right. And uh, compulsory to have a professional qualification why yes to enter a closed uh, chamber chamber means a house or whatever uh, office or a company if it is closed right what you have to do you should have a key to open the doors no right Right? Yes, yes. So the degree and the qualification is the key to enter. 
key to enter right other things will depend on your skills attitudes and mindset ani siyalla thirane wenne wage attitude ekak wage mindset ekak ewat ekka thamai and experience ekka thamai ogolange anagathe thirane wenne the experience will experience attitudes and mindset uh, will decide your future the qualification is just the key to enter right samharu hana metana ah professional qualifications while doing the degree yes definitely think of other professional qualification right you can do management courses uh, you can do some other certificate courses and uh, uh, yes you can do uh, whatever the type of uh, professional courses right ict right so do them right and get the knowledge Mm, can i do in any university but uh, the law is once you are doing a degree in a particular university so you cannot register for another but i have i don't know the uh, legal background but i have some friends who are doing the uh, degrees in Uwe, at overwellas university they have they are doing a bit in open university or some other universities right so i don't know the legal background of that but they are up, right and some are doing uh, the degrees at uh, government universities at the same time they are doing uh, chartered and sima in some other universities other private universities and foreign affiliated institutes right foreign universities and affiliated institutes they are affiliated institutes right so you can do find and do right so this will add to add value to you right uh, explain on t technology and value addition degree program okay t technology and value addition so <laughs> what will come to your mind when you think of t right a cup of t right is that <laughs> okay if you do take t technology and value addition you are exposed to china you are exposed to kenya you are exposed to all over the world who drink tea te bono one rata kata pute oya expose sela iberai hari you can do anything all around the world with tea right only thing is how you see your world how you see your world right there are seniors of uh my senior batches uh, who had done uh, uh t technology and value addition they are in top rank even in government right even government chambers they are in top ranks right wala balan you can go to the facebook and join to the uh, t technology groups and there are your seniors uh they are in top rank positions in world Uh, rank companies right some are ambassadors and some are icons uh, i don't know their uh, level uh, um t commissioners maybe in some other countries right so that much is strong positions are there for you so what are the jobs uh, can we find by export agriculture so i showed you the goal right for export agriculture or the agriculture people i showed you the goal you have to create export oriented nation in agriculture right so i don't know the number right there are plenty of job opportunities for you and you all can create your own jobs and you can create your own businesses have you have you uh, uh, watched the uh, talk with chatur youtube channel yes sir did you watch a uh, uh, uw guy was there who did mrt mineral resource technology he was there right did you watch it
is uh, samadhi i think uh, uh talk with chatur yes uh, i will shall i share the link with you mini rangoling ratama goda ganna puluwan yes uh, yes this is the link so see how you have to do yes you can be a bank manager but the bank manager is very much a smaller job for you according to me <laughs> being a bank manager is a smaller job for you right you can do more than that okay how to do assignments so don't want to ask from me just browse the internet so there are so many options right then you will learn more than the things what i am saying okay any other problem yeah highest position is the technology and value addition i don't know you can create another new one new highest position right that's why is still is still you are in a can't find mindset that is a limited mindset right so please expand your mindset right if you expand your mindset you will define your limits right new limits higher limits right don't want to confine the things what are existing now right please say about the exams i told uh, about uh, how to achieve a good result right i will upload uh, this to my youtube channel so you can uh, see them right how to achieve a good uh, result so that's all about exams right but exams is only a part of your life only a small part of your life right not the all decider of your life right what are the job opportunities for plt degree still you are in a pot tam oya inne in a box hari ap petiya kathul inna wage tam me me prashne ahanne ekai what are the job opportunities for plt degree right just browse the internet right what are the what is the position of sri lankan rubber industry this this can be applied to uh, all three degree programs just search what are the companies related to your degree program just search uh, companies related to rubber industry uh, sri lankan rubber industry right future goals of the rubber industry right so then you can see what are the things will be created in near future for you right so see this when you born right after few months of your birth were you thinking of uwa vellas university wale ipodene koi avaru deddaru deda hai de yes 1999 හරි එතකොට ඒ ඉපදිලා අවුරුදු 5ක් යනකොටවත් ඌව වෙලස් යුනිවර්සිටි එකක් ගැන හිතාගෙන හිටියද? කියන්න කියන්න. නෝ සර්. නෝ. එහෙම හිතාන හිටිය නෑනේ. නෝ සර්. බට් ඉන් විච් ඉයර් ඩිඩ් යු ඩූ දි ඕ ලෙවල් එක්සෑම්? 2016 were you aware of uvelas university there no o level karana kodat eka gana hitana hitiyena ane a level karana kodata when you do the when you did the a level no sir no but now you are thinking of your job is it realistic never is it realistic 
then job back again ah no anagate karanna puluwam monawada right so it will happens once your mind is growing right brain is growing right but you 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 are you feel fear what will happen to you in future that's why you ask in that <laughs> right so don't fear about that don't fear at that right um, the jobs will create in near future for you right the world will change right so new opportunities will develop right but you are a part of that right you can create new jobs in future right that's why i ask you the world is the way you think oya hitana vidiya thamai loke wenne right etokota you will create new jobs in future right and the new new jobs will be created for you but for that the only thing you can do is be qualified for that jobs right you have to be qualified for those jobs okay you should have the qualification only then you can enter to that and you can go through those opportunities right or else you can create a new opportunities for your young people in future let's say you will start a new company after four years right so then you can create new jobs for your uh, youngsters right so likewise the world is changing the only thing is to change is you have to change your brain you have to change your thinking pattern you have to change your attitudes you have to be qualified to be suitable for the new opportunities uh, which will be created in the future anagate godanagena aluth avasthawan walata yanna avashya qualification ekak oyata thiyenno one saha oya capable enough oyata honda skill ekak kusalathawayak thiyenno one e tana gihilla weda karanna anna e tika oya langa thiyenawa nan anagate oyata loku prashnayak athi wenne naha denoth ekena one you are qualified enough to come to overlas university that's why you are here right if you are qualified enough you will go to a place which is suitable for you or else if you are qualified enough you can create your own world and you can come to the highest position of that and you can support your youngsters uh, for their jobs means you can create a new business there another have find details through the internet with more accuracy and uh, if you if you want to browse the internet uh, you have to use keywords don't don't search like this right um uh what are the jobs for the uh, export agriculture degree program will it come what are the job opportunities and businesses can be done by the students who are doing farm and latex technology and value addition degree program of uvelas university uh, in 2022 will the google give you an answer mehem search karo google ekak answer ekak deida no definitely no diga prashna gahanna just search rubber sector in sri lanka rubber sector rubber industry in the world right top companies of rubber top top uh, companies of tea industry in the world right so you will you will find something right government uh, government institutes related to technology government institutes of uh, agriculture in sri lanka right a uh, export development board uh, companies uh, companies comes uh, come under the uh, export development board and board of investment boi right so top countries uh, dealing with rubber right top countries uh, top 10 countries of uh, agriculture sector in the world likewise you can go through this once you go to a website read all the things what you want right then you will find many detail much number of uh, much amount of details right
any other okay i think uh, you all were comfortable with my lecture and uh, and we discussed many important things uh, and uh, i hope uh, uh, you will be able to uh, go for a, a good future right just improve yourselves right don't want to change others change yourselves right then the world will be changed in future right so we will go through go to a developed country in future if you change your mindsets right in broader way okay then uh, i will upload uh, this to this uh, discussion uh, to my channel so if you prefer to learn about rubber technology and some other important facts about the university life and education system and related things so please subscribe uh, my channel never ever right okay i will share it with you right thank you very much attending for this but i will give my heartiest thank for you if you achieve the goals we set during the uh, discussion Thank you very much, sir. Okay. Thank you so much. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you, sir. Okay. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Okay. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Okay.